This is unboxing of an uh, eyepiece and uh, uh, another item. Let's go and open it. Okay, I have now ripped the lead. Oh, look, another packaging. So, that looks interesting. So, I need a scissor or knife to open this. Okay, I have now cut with the scissor the outer part. There is more packaging here, so we may have to look another packaging off. Okay, what is here? Uh, okay, I have to open this one now. Okay, I'll cut it this part now. This is from Rother Valley Optics. UK's number one astronomy center and this is the eyepiece I was talking about I put it there we we'll, we'll look at it and this is another item about so two items this is a Helios which is the old name for a sky watcher Nirvana 16 millimeter 82 degrees eyepiece so I have another one of these and I wanted to have a binary viewing experience with it. So I just bought this one also. That other one I bought it 89 pounds from the internet. Now this price has fallen to 69 pounds. So I just grabbed it. This is this is one of the most comfortable eye pieces I have ever had, I must say. It's so comfortable on the eye. And surprise, surprise, it has a good good field of view. This is the Nirvana, one of the best eyepieces I ever had. It's lightweight, it's not heavy, it has 82 degrees. At the same time, it gives me really good views. Really nice eyepiece. And it's a gem, I must say, it is a gem. It is practically a gem, this Nirvana. I don't think anybody realizes that, unless they try this. This is equal or even better to a Teleview uh, Nagler, I'm telling you. Teleview Naglers are 82 degrees field of view eyepieces in this class. There is a 4mm and a 7mm version of this also. Look at the quality of the lens here. This is the object size lens and this is the eye, lens, eye part lens. Without no doubt, I'm not exaggerating or anything, this is the most comfortable eyepiece I ever have seen, I ever have used.
Yep, the cutting in the sea of the north of the Imbrium, where the Jura Mountains is, uh, what is called actually the part near the Caucasian Mountains, is the uh, Alpine Valley. Amazing. Yeah, it's in lower part so when you see the a parallel dotted line as if parallel to that mountain inward to the, um, the sea of rains is where the Apollo 15 landed in the mountains. Try to zoom on down. 